Hey guitar buddies, let's take a look at Living for the City. Oh, what a great tune there. And uh, it's just great fun to play on an acoustic, especially a 12 string. Okay, so the original key is F sharp. So I've taken it down to E to make it easy to play on the acoustic. And so if you want to play in the original key, it's very easy to put a capo on the second fret and move everything up by two frets. Okay, so we've got this main riff. I'm playing an E. And then an F sharp minor, but I'm still leaving the E in the bass. Then a G, again leaving the E in bass. Okay, and then for the chorus, I play an A6. So that's A, uh, but with adding an F sharp on two, and just playing an A. Just enough. So you've got like a little melody on top. Just enough, just enough. So A6 to A, then B6. So just barring across on four. And then a B9. back into our main riff. And for the keyboard solo, I start by playing hammer from a B to a C sharp, and then open E. So open, two, open. And then I'm playing an E chord with a D in the bass. So open D, four, five, four. And then two, four, two, open. F sharp, G sharp, F sharp, open. And then I play an E minor seven flat five chord. So I'm playing on the A string seven, then eight, then seven, then eight. So, then I play in the top part of a C chord. So I'm playing 10, 8, 9, 8, 8. But I'm just, I start by G and I'm picking on the top G, C, G. G, C, G. Eight, eight, eight. Then I pick an open E. Gives me time to move down to a D on three. Open E again. And then a B flat chord. So. Then I'm playing a B flat with an A flat in the bass, so I'm playing four, muting the A string with my second finger. It's dead. And then three, three, three. Then adding an E flat on four. Then an F on six. A G7 chord. Then I go to an F chord and add on the F a G on 12. Then play an A on 10. Then a B natural there on 12. 
and then just move it down to an E major chord. So slowly. Great tune. Thanks for watching. Cheers.